Hello, and welcome to Interior Health's Adult Type 2 Diabetes video series. My name is Jackie, and I am a registered dietitian and diabetes educator. This video is about the glycemic index. Just a few reminders as you watch this video series. We encourage you to watch the videos in order. And just remember, you can go back and watch the videos as often as you'd like. Fraser Health On the Road to Diabetes Health is a great resource to accompany this video series. And remember, you can pause the video at any time if you would like to spend a little bit more time reviewing the information. We would like to acknowledge that our work occurs on the beautiful, traditional, ancestral, and unceded territories of the First Nations of the Interior Region. We also recognize the Métis Nation and the contributions of the Métis peoples to the Indigenous ways of being and knowing on this land. Today we are going to discuss what the glycemic index is, what are the different categories of glycemic index, and some other resources for further education on this topic. Let's get started. Once you have a good understanding of which foods contain carbohydrates and what portion sizes work best for your blood sugars, you could consider choosing carbohydrates based on their glycemic index. The glycemic index, or GI, is a scale that ranks a carbohydrate containing food or drink by how much it raises blood sugar levels after it is eaten or drank. Foods with a high GI increase blood sugar higher and faster than foods with a low GI. There are three glycemic index categories, and we can use a traffic light analogy to help us think of these categories. Low GI foods are foods we should choose most often. They include heavy mixed grain bread, steel cut oats, barley, sweet potatoes, and winter squash. Medium GI foods are foods we should choose less often or to proceed with caution. They include foods such as pita bread, rye bread, instant or quick oats, white rice, corn, or parsnips. High GI foods are foods we should choose least often or to stop and think about them. They include foods like white bread, rice krispies or corn flakes, pretzels, rice cakes, and soda crackers. The good news is that many fruits and vegetables fall in the low or medium GI categories. Almond milk, soy milk, cow milk, and yogurt are also low GI. For a list of glycemic index foods, please go to the Diabetes Canada website and search glycemic index in their search box. Another great resource is at glycemicindex.com. Thank you for watching this video about the glycemic index. We encourage you to view the remaining videos for more information about living well with type 2 diabetes.